Hi Pisces, I'm Jennifer. I'm going to do your daily reading for you. We'll find out what messages spirits have for you. I'm just going to shuffle one more time. Okay, Pisces. Get right into your reading. Okay, I saw that. What's going on here? Okay, Pisces. So this right here is a messenger, a cup of love. This can be new love. This is a page. I feel like this might be new love. There's something you're committed to, some type of a commitment, Taurus energy. And then we have Aries energy with the Emperor showing up. And um, the Hermit is here, Virgo energy. Okay. We'll get these cards laid out and then we'll go back and clarify. For the center card of your reading... The Five of Swords. There might be something you need to stick up for yourself for. And then I have the Page of Pentacles here. Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn energy. I'm, I'm seeing this as a gift. Something... Some type of a message again. Something promising. And then we have the death card. Scorpio energy. An ending. Something ended. We have the knight of pentacles. And the seven of pentacles. There could be... Um, a messenger that you're waiting for. Someone who's very very slow showing up here okay so let's clarify this page of cups up here that we're starting out the reading with why is the page of cups here spirits this could be new love coming into your life You're very, very focused on your work, Pisces. I'm seeing the initial CM. I don't know what that means. I think I saw that the other night, CM. Um, but... I feel like this is really strange energy here. I'm seeing someone offering you a cup of love. And I feel like this is new love. You can see the hand coming towards you right here. But your, your focus is somewhere else. You're looking right past it. I feel like you're up in your, like your, your work, like you're revolving around your work. There could be something here that you're worried about when it comes to your work. But you're still staying very focused. You're very committed to what you're working on. And then we have the Hierophant. Why is the Hierophant here? The Four of Pentacles, the Devil, and the King of Cups. For some of you, there's like, um, there could be...
Boy, you're kind of confusing me tonight, Pisces. It's like you're you're holding back and staying in control of your emotions when it comes to this energy of the devil. Which I'm going to clarify why the devil is here. The devil is Capricorn energy. The king of cups is Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio energy. Why is the devil here? There's your energy sitting next to the devil. And there's holding back. It's like you're staying in control of your emotions. And um, I'm not sure why this person shows up as the devil. If they're a Capricorn or they have Capricorn in their chart. Or they have some type of an addiction. When I clarify the devil... I'm getting like a younger energy here and a betrayal. This person's going, this person, I feel like just recently went through a huge betrayal and ending. And they're thinking about you. The moon is you. But they're holding back. I feel like you feel connected to this person. But you're both holding back from each other. Why is the King of Cups here? The Ten of Pentacles. The Sun. And the Page of Swords. It's like you're being very giving. You're giving to other people, Pisces. Working on your money. You're focused on your money. And your happiness. And healing. And this other person is watching you. Is this someone watching you? But they're holding back. And then we have this. Um, Emperor showing up next. Why is the Emperor here? I have Aquarius, Libra, Gemini energy, Aries energy. Cancer is strong. Um, I feel like you're, you're very strong right now. I feel like this emperor is you, Pisces. Like you've made a decision to move forward, to move towards your happiness. And you're, you're very, very strong in your mind. Like you know what you want. You're taking control. You're moving. You're moving towards a wish fulfillment. And then we have the hermit. Why is the hermit here? See, you're putting the past behind you, looking out into your future. There's something new showing up for you. It's like, it's almost here. Someone um, that shows up at the, as the devil wants a passionate beginning with you, Pisces. Um, you could be dealing with a Leo here. I have the strength card. And I'm seeing you looking away from it. Looking away from this new passionate beginning. Because your strength is somewhere else. There's something else you, that you want to put your focus into. Your heart. 
everything you have into it and you're holding up your sword to this ace of wands which is a new passionate beginning you're you're going within you could be just wanting to spend time alone right now or enjoying that and then we have the five of swords why is the five of swords here The seven of wands yeah you're you're standing up for yourself protecting what is yours you're i see you in this reading whoever this reading is for you're very closed off see there's like a there's like an entrance way to a door here and you're standing in front of it guarding it you're not letting anybody in protecting yourself but there's something here that could have to do with your stability your money um that you're waiting for and you can see that it's almost here and I believe it's showing up right here with the Page of Pentacles. Why is the Page of Pentacles here? Three of Pentacles. This could be a new job for some of you. Um, it's something, it's a new path. Because you're working on your stability. This has something, it's like there's, um, I'm trying to think of the word. See, this is hair for you, Pisces. And it allows you to build and work on your on your foundation. You don't want to go through a tower again, so you're building a stable foundation. And it's a new start for you. You're um, walking down a new path in your life. And with the Five of Wands showing up here, it's like there's competition. That's the word I was looking for competition and then we have the death card so something here is coming to an end yeah the, the world is on the bottom of the deck you're closing out a cycle Pisces entering into a new chapter in your life um i'm seeing you it's like there's something here that you're manifesting that you're kind of taking a pause because you're getting ready to literally walk walk down this new path that i feel like you've created your energy is the magician. And with the hangman here, this is Pisces energy. You are um, taking a break, taking a time out, looking at everything differently now. And then I have the two of swords. So this is... Um, A decision I'm sorry about that the dogs are barking there's a decision here Pisces
This reading is very deep, Pisces, so sorry, I'm just... I feel like... Um, I just get this feeling like you're you're closed off, not making a decision, just wanting to look at the bigger picture. You're manifesting new things into your life. And then we have the Knight of Pentacles. Why is the Knight of Pentacles here, Spirits? This is a message coming to you very, very slowly. That um, now we have the world again. This is what you've been hoping for, dreaming for. It's like you're happy. You're happy like this in the Nine of Pentacles energy. You're taking care of yourself. You're taking care of everything by yourself i'm seeing you here as being single and i have 11 11 you're on the right path there's there's news coming in that i feel like is taking too long it's coming but it's coming very very slowly and so you're kind of feeling a little bit of instability because of this when is it going to show up it it brings you into the new chapter in your life and um there's a great celebration here something that you'll be celebrating you could be celebrating this with a couple other people and then we have the seven of pentacles which is a card of waiting What have you been waiting for? Why is the Seven of Pentacles here, Spirits? Yeah, see, this is you. You're in the Nine of Pentacles energy. There's a lot of options here in front of you. But there's one particular option that you've been waiting for. And once this shows up, because I'm seeing it in your energy right now, I'm seeing something that you'll be very, very much happy about celebrating. Um, I see things moving very quickly here. It's like you've been waiting for this to come into your life, working on it, focused on it. And once it shows up, it's like, wow, okay, now you got to move quick another very quick I'm seeing messages going back and forth success and victory it's like you did it on this card right here I see like a fish jumping straight out of the water in between the two of cups a great celebration here victory success there's there's a new start there's someone new coming into your life with the two of cups here someone's going to come and speak something to you not sure what this is this is um something huge though with it showing up as the ace of swords some type of truth or knowledge that this person can give you. Okay. Let me grab you a couple of Moonology cards, Pisces. I'm just going to shuffle these and we'll get the energy going in here. What does Pisces need to know, Spirits? Take time to breathe out. And nothing is yet set in stone. Because I'm seeing you here very focused on something. And I feel like it's your money. 
there's a project here. What does Pisces need to know? Look at the bigger picture. And on the bottom of the deck, a time to give rather than take. Okay, Pisces, so these are the messages spirits have for you tonight. I hope they help, and I send you guys lots of love and light. Namaste, Pisces.